Once upon a time, in a small town nestled in the mountains, there was a young boy named Tim who loved stargazing. He spent countless nights on the roof of his house, looking up at the sky and dreaming of exploring the vast universe. One warm summer night, Tim saw something he had never seen before. A bright red light was hovering in the sky, moving in a strange and erratic pattern. Tim watched in awe as the light suddenly descended towards the ground, disappearing over the hills. Curious and excited, Tim grabbed his bike and set off towards the hills, determined to investigate the mysterious red light. As he approached the spot where he had seen it land, he saw something that made his heart skip a beat. There, in a small clearing, was a sleek, metallic object that looked like a cross between a spaceship and a sports car. It was a shiny red color, with smooth lines and a futuristic design. Tim couldn't believe his eyes, it was a UFO. As he approached the strange craft, the door suddenly opened, revealing a figure inside. Tim was momentarily paralyzed with fear, but as the figure stepped out, he saw that it was not an alien, but a humanoid creature that looked like a jaguar. The jaguar creature spoke to Tim in a language he didn't understand, but somehow, Tim was able to communicate with it through a kind of telepathy. The jaguar explained that it was from a distant planet, and had landed on Earth to explore and study the planet's inhabitants. Over the next few days, Tim and the jaguar explored the town and its surroundings together, learning about each other's worlds and cultures. Tim showed the jaguar his favorite spots, including the local observatory and the nearby lake, while the jaguar shared stories of its travels across the universe. Eventually, it was time for the jaguar to return to its home planet, but not before leaving Tim a special gift, a small crystal that glowed with a radiant red light, just like the jaguar's ship. Tim treasured the crystal as a reminder of his amazing adventure with the UFO Red Jaguar, and continued to dream of all the wonders that lay beyond his small town.